This conference will now be recorded. Hey guys, this is Naveen here. Welcome back to Naveen Automation Labs. Okay, so back to Selenium 4 series once again. So today, <clears throat> in this particular video, I'm going to cover two more new features they have added. That is, you can, uh, at the runtime, you can, uh, you know, you can generate, you can create a new tab, as well as you can create a new window also, and you can launch any internal URL or any external URL in that particular tab and the external window. So how to do that? So for doing this, let me create a class. And uh, my class name is, uh, let's see, new window and tab okay, feature. And you select the main method and click on finish. And I'll do one thing that I quickly launch my Google Chrome with some, let's see, implicitly wait. Okay, so that is the standard thing. And then what I'll do, I'll launch my URL. So driver dot get method and I'll launch the URL, let's see, http colon www.google.com, right? Perfect. And uh, what I want, I just print system dot auto print and then driver dot get title, which will give you the title of the page, right? Perfect, simple, okay, very simple thing. Now, what exactly driver says now in Selenium 4? You can now driver dot switch to dot. Earlier, if you remember that uh, we were having this particular method driver dot switch to dot window, right? Now they have introduced one more method that is called driver dot switch to dot new window method is there. So you just simply write new window, okay? And in this particular new window, you can pass either tab, okay, a new tab, or maybe a new window you want to open. So what kind of window type? So you simply write my window uh, type dot, okay? So this window type is an enum, which is either you want to open your tab or window. So let's say you want to open a tab, okay? So the moment you write this particular line, what exactly it will do? It will open a new, blank tab you want to see okay let's run it and let's see so it will open a new blank tab on the same browser you, you see google.com and you can see that a new blank tab got open right google.com and blank tab fine perfect simple okay so this is a new feature they have introduced now what i want that uh, after opening a new tab so first of all you see that okay window type is an enum you can see in Selenium 4, this is the code for Selenium 4. It's, there are two enums are available, or uh, enum uh, variables are available, window and tab, right? So this is window type is an enum. So people might ask you at a time of interview, window type is enum. Yes, it's an enum. Now, uh, what I want after opening a new tab, right? So what exactly we have written driver dot switch to dot new window. It means where exactly the driver is available. Now see it carefully, guys. This is something important to know. So this is the page that I've opened, right? This is the browser that I've opened. In this particular browser, there are two tabs, tab number one and tab number two, whatever tab number two. In tab number one, we have google.com. In tab number two, we have facebook.com. And earlier when we launched our driver, okay, and we launched google.com at line number 19, where exactly the driver? The driver is available over here, okay? The first tab. But the moment we write, Okay, driver dot get title. It will give you the title that is Google. Fine. Okay, and the moment we write driver dot switch to dot new window and window type is tab. Now the new blank window will be open, and the driver will switch over here on this particular tab. Okay, so where exactly my driver? My driver is available on the new tab. Okay, that is open. So driver control is available over here, right? And now after this, if you try to write driver.getTitle, if you try to print driver.getTitle once again, what do you think? Think about it, okay? So the moment I write driver.getTitle, it means the driver is available on the blank window, on the blank tab. So it should not give you any title. So let's see, and let's run it again. You see that new blank, okay? Because about blank is a blank title, right? So you will see that after Google, there is a blank space is coming. Okay, so don't be confused. This Google is coming because of line number 20, right? And you see that, okay, at line number 24, there is a blank thing over here. If you really want to prove, you can simply write it 
uh, after switching okay after switching title is like this now you run it again okay a new tab will be opened and then you see that after switching title is blank and before switching we were getting google it means according to the theory that uh, the title has been switched from here to here to the new tab fine okay now what i do i want to in the new tab i want to launch a url some external url or whatever the url i want to launch so simple write driver dot get get method is used to launch the url or you can use driver dot navigate dot to also so let's say i'm using dot get method www dot facebook.com right and then what i'll do again i'll try to get the title right so again i try to get the title and here at line number 27 we should get the title because we have launched the url and after launching the url facebook okay will be visible and facebook title i tried to capture so let's run it and let's see okay so you can see that now the facebook is getting open and you can see after switching title is you can see facebook login title is visible available okay available over here you got it so after switching to the window a blank window will be open right this method will itself create a new window as well as the driver will switch that's a concept is the driver will switch to the new window i mean new tab or window or whatever and then if i try to capture the title it will not give you the title because this is a blank tab but again after launching the url it will give you the title fine okay now the title is there and i want to do some work on facebook.com or the new window or whatever and once my work is done i want to capture the title once my work is done i want to close my title so what i'll do i just want to close this particular facebook.com so i simply use don't use driver.quit otherwise it will close the entire browser so i simply use driver.close method so what exactly it will do it will close the tab now okay it will close the tab okay so it will close the tab so now you run it let's see what happens in the moment you see see it will open the tab facebook.com it will capture the title and the facebook.com the tab is already closed right you can see the tab is already closed and it's printing after capturing the title of the facebook.com it's closing the tab it means the facebook.com tab will be closed now you guys tell me the system dot our print and then if you write a driver dot get title what should be the answer for this because the driver is closed see guys this there is a concept now this particular tab is closed not the driver sorry the tab is closed where is the driver now driver is lost okay this particular driver is lost it's sitting over here right so what we have to do if you run this particular program once again just to prove this particular concept that where is my driver if the driver is lost and with the same driver if you try to capture the title let's see what happens okay so close the tab so we'll close the tab okay yeah it's saying in error that no such window exception it's saying no such window target Target window already closed because where exactly the driver was available, that window is already closed, and my driver is lost. If the driver is lost, then then how can you take driver or get title? Right? This particular driver is lost. So what we have to do, we have to come back to the main window, whatever the first window is there. So how will you come back? We have to come back to the main window. So it means we have to use driver dot switch to dot window and we have to pass the window ID. But the question here is, how will you get the window ID? <clears throat> so to get the window ID, same window handler API we have to use for that, right? So what exactly I'll do that uh, once we switch to this particular window, right? After that, okay, I'll write a driver, sorry, not here. Or yeah, you can use it over here. A simple write <clears throat> driver dot get window handles method is there. Okay, it means there are after launching it, there are two tabs. One tab is for Google, one tab is a blank tab, and I want to capture the get window handles, which will give you one set of strings. 
right this is a typical handling for okay multiple windows and then let me create a reference like this so it will give you set of a string and once we get the set of a string what exactly i'll do that i'll create one uh, list object okay which will hold the string and uh, let's see this is ls is equal to new array list i don't want to use iterator you can do it like this as well you can convert your okay set to string and then you simply import this and you pass whatever the set handles reference over here you just pass it over here okay like this and once this is done it means there are two windows window ids will be there one is for the google.com and another is for the blank tab getting a point right okay and once this is done i just do one thing i just capture a string uh, parent window id is equal to ls dot get now list is order based so the first window id like this and the same thing i'll take it for the child window id also if it is needed <clears throat> and that is ls dot get one it means i have captured the window ids now and this particular window id and the child window id let's see i'll just print it on the console also that uh, let's see parent window id as well as the child window id also printed on the console fine okay so this is also done and then once you close the tab that's why we are able to we are not able to capture the title we were getting the error after closing the tab a driver is lost right guys my driver is totally lost and now we have to come back to the <clears throat> the google.com come back to the first tab we have to jump over here so how will you switch so we have to use a driver dot switch to method once again before getting the title it means after closing that second tab what i'll do driver dot switch to dot window method is there and we have to pass the window id of the parent window and the parent window id have already captured right guys parent window id like this now the driver control is available over here and then you take the title okay then you will write something like this that parent window our uh, title is something like this a first window title of parent window title whatever you want to write you can write it and then you run it now it will not give you error let's see so it's launching facebook.com and now you can see that uh, first it's printing both the <coughs> window titles i mean both the window ids parent window id child window id and after switching title it's blank and then after launching facebook.com we were getting the proper title and then we close the browser right the when we close the not the browser when we close the second tab and then we have to switch back at line number 46 right we have switched back and then again we are trying to capture the title it means we have come back to the google.com that's why we are able to get google over here right guys so this is a standard thing that we have already seen that earlier uh, how to handle multiple browsers and browser window and browser popups with the help of driver.get window handles or window handler api this particular method only new method is already available that switch is already done it will create a new tab as well as it will switch to the new tab also same thing if you really want to apply for uh, this is for the switching to a tab let me comment it <clears throat> and if you want to do a new window so you simply write dot window it means instead of tab it will open a new window actually so a blank window okay so you run it and let's see Now you see it. Instead of opening a new tab, it's creating a new window. Actually, you can see that. And on the new window, it will open Facebook.com, capture the title for Facebook, close the window, and come back to the parent window. Come back to the main window that is Google.com, and exactly same thing we are doing it over here. Right, guys? So we have uh, okay switched to this particular child window or the second window, capture the title for Facebook.com, and then come back to Google.com. Okay, close the browser and come back to Google.com, and that's where we are able to get Google title, right? So this is a new feature they have added in Selenium 4 as well. Driver dot switch to dot new window method, window dot type I mean window type dot tab, 
and window type dot window and window type is the enum. Okay. So this is again a very small feature and a very good feature they have recently available. I mean, recently uh, present in Selenium Core. Earlier we were facing this problem that okay, how to open a, a new tab. We were using some JavaScript method or JavaScript executor. We were not having direct methods available. So I think this is a really good feature they have added as a really good value addition in Selenium 4. Right, guys? So that's all for this particular video. If you have some uh, some other understanding about this particular video or about this concept, please, or if you have any question, please feel free to write your question in the description, I mean, in the comment section. Okay. So thanks for watching this particular video, guys, and I'll see you in the next video.